When English language learners are struggling, it's important for teachers to know where to start. And so one place they need to start is by looking at everything else before looking at the learner. And that means I need to look at my teaching and make sure that the way that I'm teaching reading and writing is appropriate for second language learners. But most importantly, I need to look at the text that I'm putting in front of the learner and really know how to look at the demands that are in those texts. When I say demands, I mean the demand of the background knowledge that's expected by the text. Is it reasonable to expect that this student who's coming out of Guatemala would have the knowledge that's expected by this text? I also need to look at the, the demands of vocabulary. How many words is this student going to bump into that they're not going to know? And so sometimes the problem is not in the student the reason that they're struggling. It's in the text that we're putting in front of the student. So certainly we want to consider everything else first before considering that the problem lies in the student.